Hey loves, it's Emo Nay back with another video. I know, y'all, it's been a minute. Um, I have a lot to update you guys on. So, it's been five months since I've been living out in Houston. If you know, you know. If you don't know, go look at my other videos. And join the family, subscribe to this channel. Uh, so, this month, is i'm gonna say god is doing things he's doing amazing things um i got a new job as a therapist y'all when i say i don't even have a degree i'm in a training class with people who have master degrees and people who've been working as teachers principals and I'm just like, God placed me in this room. He qualified me because I am I know I'm not qualified. Like, I don't have this, or, you know, I don't have the credentials for this job. But some way, somehow, I'm in the room. So when I say God will place you in rooms, he really will. And I'm just so grateful. I'm so grateful. Like... Just a month ago, I didn't know what I was going to do. I didn't know how I was going to pay my bills. I didn't know, you know, like, God is amazing. Glory to God. Um, So, that's that. I'm still trying to build my clientele up. Uh, I just had a birthday. My birthday was May 19th. I'm a Taurus. Taurus gang. Um, I enjoyed my birthday. I went to Kiss. It was a nice restaurant, and then we went to like a little calm little spot to do, have some drinks. And y'all, when I tell y'all, I was so drunk, I don't even want to drink anymore. Like, I think I'm done with the drinking. <laughs> like, I, I'm really good on that. Yes, yeah, so I got this new job. I'm excited about that. Still trying to build myself up, you know, get my clientele um, together, even though. God bless this amazing job. I am still putting my dreams first. Like, I really want to own my own beauty salon. Like, that's always going to be in my forefront. But I do believe having a career job is important to just to have that safety net. Because being a business owner... And a service provider it's very hard and you know it's not stable it's not stable Most, like if you if you are a hairstylist or entrepreneur you know like when times get rough when business gets slow it's very hard so I rather have that security but still have my business because my business is really my baby and I will never, ever, ever give up on my baby. So, other than that, um, my birthday really was good. My aunt came down for my birthday. It was a smooth sailing. Like, we did not argue. We did have, like, one little argument. But other than that, she loved it here. She said she was thinking about moving out here. Her brother lives out here, so... You know, who knows? Like, she needs to be in a better environment. And I really feel like, you know, God brought me here just so she will come. Because mine I don't like leaving New York. Like, New York is just, like, her home for her. So, hopefully, like, you know, she sees that as more to life. And she'll want to move out here someday. Don't mind that stuff. Um, Y'all, I'm trying to uh, set some orders. But look, like, she did a little decorations, you know? Like, she did her little razzle-dazzle in my apartment. And I'm just so thankful. I'm grateful for everything that's coming together. Uh, not gonna lie. I'm struggling once again this month. And that's only because I just started this job and I haven't gotten paid yet. So, I'm like, how the hell am I going to pay my rent this month? But, God, God, 
he's gonna he's gonna do something and I, I'm praying that he gives me some type of creative something you know because it, it is hard especially this day and age by yourself single it's hard y'all that's why I keep telling y'all don't rush it if you're living at home you got help and you got a man relax relax because it's not an easy walk but and I honestly don't want to be this independent black woman I want a husband I want a kid I want those things but right now I'm being so intentional with my life like I'm being so intentional with the people that I have around me like I don't want to just have anybody in my space I want them to be God sent like I want everything to align the right way so that's why I'm just so picky and I'm just not letting just anybody into my life because it will cost you it will cost you a lot and I have too much to lose so I'm being real patient with myself, with God. Like I need to learn myself more. I need to love myself more before I even like start getting back in the dating world and all of that. But when I tell you I have not been dating anyone, I've not went on one date since I've been here. Well, I went on one date when I first got here and that was the end of that. But other than that, like I've really been to myself i really been getting closer to God and um, yeah, like that's that's really what I've been, I'm sorry, I just seen a fly, but that's really what I've been up to lately. Um, I really just want to want to get my life together, you know, like I'm just in that stage where I need to get stable. Like, it's so much things I need to do. I still don't have a car. I'm struggling financially. Like, I don't have nothing to offer anybody. So